Welcome back to Across Louisiana. You know, everybody is familiar with the great work being done here in the greater Baton Rouge area by Habitat for Humanity. And there's an exciting event coming up that's going to let them keep doing great things like that. And here to tell us all about it is Lynn Clark. Welcome back to the show. Good morning. For folks who may not realize what Habitat for Humanity is about and the impact that they've had right here in Baton Rouge, tell them a little bit about that. Well, Habitat is a worldwide Christian-based housing ministry, and our goal is to end poverty housing. And the way we do that here in Baton Rouge is to work with low-income families and the community to build homes. We then sell the homes to the family at a 0% interest mortgage. And because of the wonderful generosity of the Baton Rouge community, we've completed 300 120 homes and that puts us Man. in the top 3% of affiliates across the U.S. So we're really proud of that. It's always such a great story all the way around from from the great volunteers that come together mm -hmm. to make something like this happen. Uh, the places are always beautiful and then and then you know to see those folks when they walk through that door the right. first time is really an experience not to be missed. Really because they've worked so hard each one of our homeowners has to put in 355 hours of sweat equity building their house and other habitat homes and I can tell you when you're building in July it's <laughs> really sweat no equity. No question about it. <laughs> and they have a mortgage just like any other person who goes to a bank so they pay a monthly payment to us and we use that payment to help us build more Habitat homes. So they're helping other families. I mean, this is really and, and truly a life-changing event for, for so many people. And I know you have an exciting event coming up that's going to let you keep doing that great work. Tell me a little we bit about do. the bash. We're celebrating our 10th year of the Women Build. And we've built 10 houses, all with women volunteers. Very exciting. And one of the ways we help um, fund that house is through a fundraiser called the Pink Tool Bell bash and it'll be August 25th at the Renaissance Hotel on Blue Bonnet and from 6 to 8 p.m. and it's a uh pink drinks and <laughs> hors d'oeuvres and great silent auction. It's a lot of fun and all woman event. So we get people come once a year and get to see each other and visit and help another woman help her family rise above poverty to a better life. Tell me a little bit more about that because I know in my experience with Habitat for Humanity, the crew was mixed, but these are right. all women crews. Sort of what was the thought behind that? Well, oftentimes when women go on the build site, they're a little intimidated because sure. it's not usually their comfort zone. And so with the women build, they can come out and be encouraged by other women, learn a skill that they might not otherwise have had. And I can tell you that a lot of our women have come back every year for 10 years. And they, their husbands say how they've you know, totally redone their house, put <laughs> siding on it, all those kind of things. So it's very empowering for the women to come out and learn these skills and real and at the same time working alongside a woman who's trying to make a better life for her family and I mean that's the thing people realize that this obviously is going to benefit the folks that are exactly. getting the houses but they may not realize that they're going to pick up exactly uh, I mean aside right. from the rewarding experience they're going to pick up skills that they can so, take with them and use through life right that's the truth yes and I can tell you our um, families work so hard to get to this they set a goal most of them are working one or two low-paying jobs so to find time to do that sweat equity, but they really want this for their family. And all of the statistics show that uh, home ownership is very important in stability within families, regardless of the socioeconomic level. Well, the Pink Tool Belt Bash is bound to be a good time. I know folks be. are going to want to take part and support such a great cause. Tell everyone one more time where they can go to find out more information and what they need to do to take part. Sure. It's August 25th, and we have lots of information on our Facebook page and also our website, which is habitatbr.org. Lynn Clark, everybody, thanks so much for coming on and telling oh, us thank about you it. So sure much. Thing. Well, when we come back on Across Louisiana, we'll find out what's cooking at the East Baton Rouge Parish Library. Don't miss it.